And Williamson County emergency managers and responders are also on standby as this freeze sets in. Yes, leaders tell KXAN's Mercedes Hernandez they don't take calling people in over the Christmas holiday lightly. It's hitting Waco right now. They're dropping into the 20s. And so we have about, but you know, another hour. At the Office of Emergency Management for Williamson County, Michael Shue's biggest concern. If the power goes out, then yeah, we'll, we'll be in a lot of trouble. We've already spoken with the power uh, utility providers, texting them, everything okay, yeah, no problem. So yeah, it seems it, it's just going to be cold. It's up to cities in the county to set up emergency warming centers if needed. The city of Round Rock says it will consider opening a center if the power goes out. The city of Georgetown says it's partnered with local charities and agencies to secure hotel vouchers for those in yeah, need. So during weather like this, this is the only time really that we're able to help people with immediate shelter. One of them is the Caring Place. They handle needs like food and rental assistance, but we have housed for the next freezing days um, about 18 different families, um, and that was the, the availability this season. So it does fill up quickly when people see that weather rolling in. Shu says emergency operations will stay on standby unless the county gets 911 calls related to weather. Until then, if there's not the need there, then I don't want to take away people's time with their families. In Georgetown, Mercedes Hernandez, KXAN News.